Hello everyone. In this video, we try to compare with a cool spot against uh, chat GTP and see which of these tools are mostly useful for paraphrasing. So if anyone of you who do not know what is a cool spot, so this is one of the subscription. So for this sake of video, I buy the premium cool spot. Uh, cool spot will help you to paraphrase the document. So what we do, is we go to the Google, we write down accounting. So in the accounting, the first Wikipedia page come up and we copy and paste this whole text into a Word file. And uh, after doing the formatting and few more things, um, here's the document. So this is a document which I get is almost 2,743 words. You can see on my left-hand side below, uh, so this is a document which we copy and paste all the way from Wikipedia. And then I check its plagiarism. So the plagiarism rate for I authenticate was 100%. And which is very obvious because I copy and paste from the Wikipedia, so it should be 100%. Then what we do, we copy and paste the same text uh, in the quiz board, uh, which is a premium version or a paid version. And after I copy and paste it, I make the synonyms to be maximum. Uh, I try to be a creative uh, writing and, and I get the results. So after I get the results, I copy and paste on the right hand side and uh, again make a new file with the name of a quiz board. So quiz board is this one and this 2700 words are changed to 2822 words. So quiz board kind of like be more creative and add extra words to it. So I, I take this file and I check on a paid software, which is a I authenticate and um, the plagiarism rate for the quiz board was 33%, which is quite impressive uh, to be asked because um, it's a paid software though, but it not only increases the number of words, but also take away almost 67% of the plagiarism. Now, um, on other end, we take the same summary from the accounting, put it into the Word file, and then we go to the chat GDP. In the chat GDP, the very first time, if I say paraphrase the following, and I paraphrase means I just copy and paste the whole text. So the first reply which I get is, the message you submit is too long. Please reload the conversation and submit something shorter. So what I do, I kind of like take it para by paragraph and paraphrase it each uh, para by para and copy and paste and create a new file and upload in iAuthenticate. Uh, whereas the iAuthenticate give a score for chat GDP, which was 67% plagiarism. It is not bad because it's a free software and it's kind of like take one third of your plagiarism from the document. Uh, but one more problem which I faced, once I copy and paste in chat GTP, I find like I write a lot of words, like two, three, four paragraphs, and it's kind of like summarized into few words. So my 2,700 something words in chat GDP document, only the main, uh, I think it was 700 something. Yeah, 710 words on it. So it take away most of my words from the original document and paraphrase it. And still the plagiarism rate is 67%. So I'm not encouraging to abuse the plagiarism thing, uh, but I, I'm just making a comparison between a paid pills board versus chat GDP. And I think still, the premium version of the quiz board is better uh, than the chat GDP. So remaining decision, I leave it up to you. Take care, bye-bye.